Welcome to Aurora Chemistry for everyone. In this video, we are going to discuss about isotopes, isobars and isotones based on their properties and differences. Isotopes Atoms of same element having same atomic number but different mass number are called isotopes. For example, you can say that hydrogen, these are the three isotopes of hydrogen. Isobars Atoms of different elements having same mass number but different atomic numbers are called isobars. Example, you see that calcium and argon. So, atomic number is different but at the same time they both have that same mass number. Isotones. Atoms of different elements having same number of neutrons but different number of protons are called isotones. So, for example, boron and carbon, you can see that atomic number is different, they both have that 7 neutrons. So to remember them easily, just to see that isotopes, here the P represent same proton, then isobars, same weight, because in Greek baros means weight. Isotone, here you can see N, so N means same neutron. Let us see that how we can differentiate them. Isotopes, they have same atomic number but isobars mass number is same for isotones they have same number of neutrons if you see isotopes they have different mass number or number of neutrons are different but for isobars they have different atomic number or number of protons for isotones they have different atomic number or number of protons if you see isotopes, their physical properties are different but chemical properties are same. But in isobars and isotones, they have different chemical properties. Why isotopes have same chemical properties? Because they have equal number of, same number of electrons. So that decide the properties of, chemical properties of isotopes. Let us solve few questions. See the first question, the schematical, the schematical representation of the following atoms represent isotopes, isobars and isotones. In the schematic diagram, you can see that proton, number of proton for the first one 6 and then for the second one also 6, then the third one also 6. That means same proton. So same proton means isotopes. You can see that number of electrons also same but that number of neutrons are different. So these are comes under isotopes because of same proton. So isotope is the correct answer. See the second one. So if you see that silicon and phosphorus, atomic number is different. So they do not have that same proton. For isobars, they should have that same weight but for silicon and phosphorus if you see 30 and 31 so they are not isobars so there is a possibility for isotones let us subtract and see for 30 minus 14 for silicon we will get 16 same way for phosphorus 31 minus 15 also we will get 16 neutrons so they both have that same number of neutrons so they are isotones last question the composition of two atoms a and b are given below so they are isotopes isobars or isotones for isotopes there should be a same proton but if you see that A and B protons are different and also neutrons also different. So there is no possibility for isotones. So now we go to see that whether they are isobars or not. So for that we need to check their atomic mass. For A, 18 plus 22 that means proton plus neutron that is equal to 40. For B also 20 plus 20 so that is equal to 40. That means same number of mass. Since the same number of mass, these are isobars. Thanks for watching.